Do you know that when Christ saved you, He made you a radical. You know what a radical is? Somebody that's just nuts over something. That might not translate really good. But what I mean by that is somebody's just absolutely crazy or fanatical about something. I know some people that if they get in the right club, the right football league or the right, the right social league or the right, the right game league or something like that, it consumes them and their desires. That's what they pursue with their life. It could be gardening. Have you ever seen somebody that was really nuts over gardening? I mean, I've learned that you can grab different plants with different plants and come up with different plants. It's like a science. I don't know where you can learn all this stuff. I'm not saying that gardening is wrong, but when it becomes the life pursuit, or maybe it's not gardening, maybe it's Freemasonry or dominoes or, or youth leagues or, or band leagues or something, whatever, whatever club it is, that's all they talk about. When you walk up to them and say, hey, how you doing? Boom, they go right to that conversation. Because that's the pursuit and the desire, the number one thing in your life. The topic of discussion, though for the Christian, if he's pursuing Christ, ought to be all about the glory of Christ. Amen? When Christ came, He made all things new within us. The topic of the discussion and the practice of your life is now focused and it's now fixed on Jesus and on spreading His glory.